Noise reduction allows you to remove or reduce background noise from your recordings. In this tutorial, you will learn how to reduce noise in Audacity. Open your audio file in Audacity. We will be using an example file for this demonstration. Note the noise in the background. In this video, we will show you how to use the noise reduction tool in Audacity. Start by selecting a section of the audio containing only the noise that you want to reduce or remove. Try the beginning or the end of your recording or look for a good pause somewhere in your track. You want to select enough of the audio in order to get a good analysis of the noise. Now go into the Effect menu and scroll down to Noise Reduction. Then click on Get Noise Profile. This will close the dialog box and create a sample of your noise. Audacity uses that sample to analyze and extract the noise from your signal. Now select your entire timeline by double-clicking on your audio track. Then go back into the Effect menu and select Noise Reduction again. There are three adjustable settings that you can use to fine-tune your noise reduction. Each of these controls affects the way in which the noise is reduced. Raising them too high will remove more noise, but at the expense of some of your audio quality. Setting them too low will keep more of your desired audio signal, but it can also retain some of the noise. So adjust these to the levels that are satisfactory to you. The first control is Noise Reduction Amount. This setting reduces the identified noise in decibels. Adjust it to a point where you feel enough of your noise has been removed. You can click on the Preview button to hear the results of your settings as you alter them. The Sensitivity setting controls how much of the audio is considered noise. Setting the sensitivity too low can result in higher frequency distortions in the audio. Therefore, set this to the lowest level that achieves a satisfactory amount of noise removal without introducing distortions. The final control is frequency smoothing. This control helps smooth out possible distortions that occur due to increasing the frequency range of the noise being reduced. A higher setting will make your audio signal less clear, so keep it low or even off. The default settings work well for basic noise removal. Another way to hear the effect of your settings is to listen to only the parts of the signal being removed. You can do this by selecting the Residue option in the Noise setting. Select this option and press Preview. This is useful for finding the optimum settings that do not damage the audio. If you can hear recognizable bits of the desired sound in the residue, it is likely that you have set noise reduction or sensitivity too high. Now change the noise setting back to Reduce, and then press OK. In this video, we will show you how to use the Noise Reduction tool in Audacity.